Welcome back to the Power Public YouTube channel. Today we're going to be unboxing a brand new Rotax Senior Max 125 race engine. So let's get to it. Now, if you've been following it along and seen some of our unboxing videos, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notifications button and you will be notified when the next video is about to drop. So, if you've never had a Rotax before, they come with everything as you're about to find out. In here is the exhaust and the radiator, all the bits and pieces that you'll need. Even throw in a um, throttle cable. Okay, so it really is the full box pass, as they say. Okay, so first up we've got our sort of black box there. That's the ignition module, the brains of the operation, as they call it. Uh, this is for the power valve. This is the inside here. We've just got some couple of cable ties and some this is the hose that goes for the crankcase, so I'm going to show you how to do that in another video. Uh, this is the, all the, for the operation of the power valve. So we've got the air filter and the filter screens. We've got the top of the air box, bottom of the air box. We've got the adapter flange and the intake tubes for the air box. It all comes separate. Uh, we've got a charger cord for the battery charger. This brand new carburetor, and that carburetor comes. It's a slide carburetor, so it's got the slide and the and the cap all as one assembly. So we've got the um, these are the this is the bracketry for putting the battery bracket on. Oops. And it comes with all the hardware. This little bag of goodies is all your hose clamps, the water hoses, and exhaust. Might as well just open it, eh? Show you all that. So in the bag, you've got your spark plug, fuel filter. This is the exhaust bracket and the rubbers, radiator mount, hose clamps, hose clamps for the air box. These are the exhaust mounts, the rubber isolators. This is the exhaust ring. We've got our two water hoses. Obviously go with our two hose clamps. The air box hardware and some other hardware. The exhaust springs. Yeah, so that's what all comes in that bag, and our um, anti-vibration rubber that we, this goes in the battery bracket, so your battery goes in here, but I'll show you all that later. Okay, they send us a, uh, a battery, and then there's a little bag of terminals. These ones are pretty cool because they send us the um, acid separate to the battery. So in here is the battery acid, we're going to put that in, charge the battery up for the first time. So it's brand new, fresh, ready to go. In here we have fuel line, and the fuel pump and the, and the bracket, the air box mounts to here. This screws to the front of the engine, I'll show you that later, or in another video. Uh, yes, this is the new Evo style battery bracket. This mounts over here on our left next to the seat. Uh, the battery obviously goes inside here. We mount the ECU, where am I to put that, over here. Okay, so that goes in this, this is the new anti-vibration mount developed by Rotax. It's a great idea, stops all the vibration and the harmonics going through the little electronics in this black box. And then in here, this is all the power valve. Yeah, and Rotax, they're really clever, they number all their parts. The, the system here that they've got is really top shelf. They are, if you ever got to reorder stuff, it makes it very easy. So this is your ignition. The coil this is going to bolt to the side of the motor. Uh, the little hose for the power valve and some cable ties. Thousands of cable ties. In here we've got the battery charger and our little adapter so that guy just clips in there and our power lead goes in there so they even send us a uh, battery charger so you can charge your battery and the harness on your Rotax engine has a, uh, an adapter on it and this will plug straight into it so you don't actually have to unclip anything, you just go up to the, the FEMA, plug this guy straight in, turn it on, and it'll charge. And it's got an indicator light here, 
Um, and yellow is charging and green is when it's in trickle mode or full charge. Obviously, water-cooled motors need a radiator. One of Rotax's finest. Comes here all nicely packaged up individually. It's got the radiator flap. It's got the radiator flap on it. Radiator cap. Inside here is your warranty information, some stickers, um, the user manual, some Rotax blurb. This is your little warranty card. Fill that out and send it back with the copy of your receipt. And this actual engine package comes with a 12 month warranty here in Australia. Sometimes it's six months, but at the moment it's 12 month warranty. A little badge for your race suit and service catalog. Trust the old throttle cable. Thanks, Rotax. And lastly, but not least, the muffler. That's why the box is so damn big, I guess. I've got this monster. Monster Evo exhaust pipe. You know, there's been a few renditions of this. The guys that know Rotex products. Okay, we've got a slip joint here, um, some springs to hold it all together, a little cradle here to take the stress out of the pipe. We did have a lot of problems with them tracking along this seam in the last version. These newer versions are excellent. It's been superseded, and uh, yeah, you won't have any problems with these. Okay, so your Rotex engine comes in this box. It is all packed up, separate from everything else, obviously and it comes with uh, packaging all around it obviously coming all the way from Austria here to Australia it's got cardboard everywhere packaging, more packaging and lastly but not least just drop this over the edge and then voila okay we've pulled the plastic off We've got a little sticker here and on that as you're running in instructions. Got three sessions, 15 minutes, up to 10,000, up to 12,000, and then the full load. So there you have it, the Rotax Evo 125. This is an incredibly fun engine for go-karting. It's got tons of power. These, this new Evo Carby is nice and easy to jet once we get them set up. Now, there is a couple little tricks. We have a video on how to tune your Delorto carburetor. It's not 100% complex like some people will have you believe. I like to think of them as, um, you know, you, there's a couple little speed bumps, but it's mostly plain sailing. Also too on the Evo engine, which is, you can tell with the red cylinder head and the black crankcase. This is the latest and the greatest cylinder from Rotax. They're senior max engines. These are, the parity on these engines is excellent. We have had variations before. They're working on making them more perfect. This Evo power valve is one of my favorite things about these engines. If, if anything, that was the Achilles heel. Down low, the bottom RPMs of 6,500 to 7,500. It was a little bit hit and miss, depending on you. The jetting, the AG of bell lows, the gear ratio, throttle position, stuff like that. It really affected how quickly the power valve would operate. Now, these things are magic, they're new electro pneumatic control, and they're just excellent. Magically, they stay closed till 7,500, then boom, just snap straight open. You can see that when we use them on the dyno through this little window here, and you can see the power valves opening at 7.5. They will stay shut until that. That's really a really great feature of this. Uh, 125 engine. So there you have it, the 125 Senior Max Rotax racing engine, an awesome piece of gear. I love this engine, love the power, and you're gonna love it too if you get yourself one here at Power Republic. Now, if you love watching these videos, don't forget to subscribe and give us a thumbs up. And if you've got any questions about this engine or the carburetor, leave it in the comment section below. Follow us on Instagram and Facebook at Power Republic. Well, go to our website, www.powerrepublic.com.au. Get yourself a t-shirt or a hoodie. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.